recognizes Mr. Burleson from Missouri. Director Cheadle, um, I just want to kind of get an idea of what you can answer, um, because outside of what the FBI is responsible for, you have full responsibility for the Department of, of Secret Service. So the question is, what is the mission? What is your, what's the, who did, and who defines the mission? Our mission of the Secret Service is to protect uh, the president, the vice president, uh, their immediate families, uh, presidential candidates, the former presidents, and uh, those by executive order. And we also have an investigative mission. And, and those are well defined? Yes, they Everyone do. within the agency understands the mission? Yes, they do. What about protocols and standards? Who defines the protocols and standards? We have a number of protocols and policies in place for uh, the various uh, missions that we have. So would it, would it be safe to say that you failed the mission, the ultimate mission? I have stated repeatedly here today that there was a failure. What about specific failures within protocols and, and guidelines within the agency? Again, I am uh, certain that the investigation that is being conducted internally as well as the external investigation. You said, you said earlier in the hearing that there was either a communication, there was, a, there, was a, there was errors in communication or in operations. Could it be both? Uh, in, in both errors in operational decisions and errors in communications? I think the investigation potentially could uh, identify both. So I want to talk about communications. Um, Representative Bobert asked earlier about using encrypted apps that you said you've not used, I guess, Signal. Um, are you, have you used any encrypted app to communicate on, from your personal device? I do, on occasion, uh, use encrypted apps to communicate. Uh, so you use some form of an encrypted app to communicate with, with people within the federal government? with local law enforcement? Whom, whom are you communicating using the encrypted apps? Uh, many times it's with colleagues and, uh, and associates. So you're communicating with colleagues on a personal device? There are times that the Secret Service, when we work uh, internationally uh, with some of our partners, that they don't have the same texting capability. And you, you're not able to do that with your, with your government issued device? Uh, recently, we have been able to uh, install some of those apps on government devices. Okay. Um, let's talk about some of the things uh, that we can get access to. I I'm actually shocked that you are using your personal device um, and encrypted communication tools. I think that that might be the most shocking thing that I've heard today. I didn't expect that you to, for you to say that. Um, the, we have requested, this committee has requested multiple documents. And this is not, you know, in, under the purview of the FBI, this is under your purview. We requested a complete list of all law enforcement personnel, including Secret Service, Department of Homeland Security, local law enforcement with the roles in protecting the president. And we requested that to be, re for us to receive that by July 18th. Did we, did you provide that? I believe that our agency is in the process of collecting all documents. So you did requested. not, pro you have not provide, provided it. How long does it take to determine who the, the personnel were that were on site? We are collecting a comprehensive list of all the documents that have been requested. We also requested all the audio and video recordings that your agency, not the FBI, but your agency has in possession related to the event. Did we receive those? Have you provided those at all? We are in the process of collecting all documentation requested. You're in the process, but you have not. Um, any memorandums or any internal communications related to the, to the event? You, you, we requested that you provide that. Have you provided any of that? We are in the process of collecting the information that has been requested. Okay. So when can we expect to receive these documents? How long does it take to... To, to determine who was on site, who was, who was being employed to be there to protect the, pre, the former president. Uh, when can we expect that? How, long, how many days does it take to provide that information? We want to make sure that we have a comprehensive uh, 
accounting of all of the documents uh, that were engaged in that day, and we will make them available as soon as possible. I think transparency is the key here. It's shocking to me that we are communicating in, in an um, encrypted app to colleagues. Um, I, I'm almost certain that violates some federal laws. I, I would like to clarify, you didn't ask me whether my communications were uh, government work related or whether they were personally related. You're communicating I with colleagues. I don't communicate uh, government business with colleagues on a personal device. I communicate on my work device. Are you using an encrypted device on your work device? I am not. No, no encrypted apps? No, I do not. Okay. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. Chair, now recognize Mr. Waltz from Florida.